Welcome back. Now we'll be understanding about hiding and unhiding. Hiding and unhiding is very important. Sometimes you don't want to show all the information to everyone. So you keep on hiding the data. That's one reason. And second, sometimes not so important data should be hidden so that it is you know quick for end user to understand. So how do we hide columns, rows and sheets? That's a topic right now we'll be learning. So first thing, let's say this is the data. We have serial number, name, product, month, quantity and value. These are few columns. I want to hide the data here. Suppose I want to hide one column. I will select on the C column, right click and I can click on hide. The moment I click on hide, the C columns has been hidden between B and D column. So B, D column, okay, in between there's a C column. If I want to make it visible, I have to select this B and C, B and D column like this. I have to select this continuous column, right click and then click on unhide option. Okay, so when I do this unhide, the hidden column is visible. The other method, if you forget, this is the shortest method, but if you are a student or a, in a college or school, then they will ask you in which menu bar do you find out the hide option. So here we go, we can go to the home menu bar and here on the right hand side option which you see format and here if you see there is an option given as hide and unhide. So hide and unhide option, I have selected that column. So if I say hide columns, when I do that, the selected column would be hidden, control Z. So if I select this multiple columns like this and here if I go for format and if I say uh, hide and unhide, if I say hide columns, all selected three columns would be hidden. Okay, if you see that option is hidden here. Now let me minimize and then you can see. So if I select multiple rows over here like this and suppose I want to hide this rows, I can obviously right click on the row heading and I can click on hide option. So this way I can hide the rows as well. So uh, hiding, unhiding is important that can uh, help you to uh, keep your data maybe confidential. The other option is if you want to hide a sheet and unhide a sheet, you can just right click on the sheet name and here comes as hide. When you hide the sheet, it becomes easy for us to work on. Number one, when you send the file to some other person, they can see only these two sheets. But if the person is smart enough like you, then you can right click on that, uh, you know, sheet name, any sheet name and then click on unhide. Now here, in this dialog box, there's only one sheet, but obviously if there are 10, 20 sheets hidden, you can unhide multiple sheets. So I can click on OK and the sheet would be visible here. So this is how you can hide and unhide. Now the thing is, uh, if you don't want the person to unhide the sheet, you have sent a file to someone else and they are unhiding the sheet. If you don't want them to do that, you can protect the file with a password. Okay, workbook structure and the file password, you can see in the previous videos, we have covered that topic. So this was about the hiding and unhiding sheets inside Microsoft Excel. I hope you have understood. That's all for this video.